Hi guys, I'm George with Heverniti, owner of Frank's Pizza House. You're probably watching this video today because you probably purchased or received a pizza kit. Now, I'll unveil the pizza kit for you guys. Pizza kit from Frank's Pizza House involves three dough balls. We got some homemade Italian tomato sauce, some fresh mozzarella, and some Ronnie cups. Pepperoni, small pepperoni. So what I like to do before I make my pizza, a couple rules I like to follow. One, always preheat your oven. 450, 500, before you start anything. And then your little bags, I like to rip them all open. You have some plates ready where everything falls right into place. You got your runny cups. Again, put them right into the plate. Mozzarella. This is gonna be easy, fun for the entire family. So it's all about having fun, good time, and making yourself a great, great pizza. So what I like to do, when you receive your dough, it will be coated with some semolina. Have some flour handy. Give it another little coating. Again, with your fingers, gently press down. Press around, work it softly, and you'll find the dough very soft, very forgiving, easy to work with. Uh, if you do put a hole in it, it'll be easier to mend back together. So I'm just giving it a little smack. This will be around 10 inches. Again, oven preheated. Fist motion. You just spin. Nice and gentle. So like I said, your oven's preheated at 500. I like to cook my pizza for about 12 to 15 minutes, but because every oven varies a little bit, keep an eye on your pizza. Some people like it more well done. Some people like it more doughy and chewy. So it's just a preference thing. So I have my pizza stretched out. One, two, about three ladles. Nice coating, nice and simple. Now, again, you can put whatever you like on your pizza, but the kit involves the cheese and pepperoni, but you can go crazy, but whatever you like. Where to put my mozzarella? Here we go. Just a light dusting. My pepperoni, my favorite. These are small little pepperonis. Great. I know everybody has a different preference on pizza, uh, different takes on pizza. Uh, the, the flour we use is a traditional flour with some semolina. This is not a double zero flour uh, pizza dough. Uh, but again, this works great in the oven. Uh, we have people who purchase it from us for their wood burning backyard ovens. Uh, easy to use uh, and again, very forgiving. So that's your basic pizza as of now before it goes into the oven. I'll place it into my oven and we'll come back and we'll see you soon. Pizza should just be about done. Let's open her up. Look at that. Nice looking pizza. Put it down. You got your nice golden color. Your undercarriage bottom of the pizza is nice golden. And that's what you're looking for. Now you can tell if you got a good solid dough is when you cut that pizza, you hear that crunch. So let's put it to the test, guys. Here we go. I cut mine into six, you can cut it into four. Let's see, let's see, we can lift one up. There we go. We got a nice little cheese ball. See, taste rough. It's gonna be hot. I'm gonna burn my mouth. Perfect every time, guys. Hopefully, you guys get to enjoy your pizza kit with your friends and family. It's all about fun and good times. You can find this on Facebook, Instagram, or at frankspizzahouse.ca or at 1352 St. Clair Avenue West. We're here all the time. Thanks a lot, guys. Hopefully, we'll see you soon. Ciao for now.